Hi, I'm Donald Neidig. I'm going to tell you about the program for March at the Academy for Learning in Retirement. Uh, there will be two speakers. <clears throat> On the 5th and 7th of March, we're having Dr. Jim Peach from the Economics Department at NMSU. On the 5th of March, he's going to talk about the continuing recession and its, and its effects on the New Mexico economy, particularly the poor, and how poverty is primarily a policy decision rather than a lack of resources or technology. I've heard a, a snippet of this one already, and I know it's really good. Then on March 7th, uh, Jim's going to talk about a brief history of the U.S. energy policy, why a national energy policy is needed, and why such a plan is an unlikely outcome of current policy debates that are going on right now. Okay, then on March the 12th, I will be the second speaker. And uh, we're going to begin with a tour of the heavens. And this is going to feature some of the best images from the Hubble Space Telescope, as well as other astronomical interests. As in any tour, we'd like to have a map. Such as this one. In fact, everyone that attends is going to get one of these, and we're going to use this as a basis for our tour. I'm going to show how such maps are constructed and then proceed with a tour of the sky. And we'll stop from point to point on our map and there'll be discussions about the physical interpretation and the significance of the objects that we visit. Then on March 14th, uh, the second topic is going to be, of my topics, is going to be how bright is the sun? Well, that sounds pretty specialized, but make no mistake, this turns out to be a fascinating story in itself and it has major implications for Earth's climate, past, present, and future. And we're going to do an on-stage experiment that illustrates how modern techniques for measuring the sun's brightness have worked so well. Thank you, and I hope to see you on March 5th, 7th, 12th, and 14th.